In Sacramento tonight, Democrats are at odds with Democrats. They're fighting over a controversial proposal by Governor Brown to overhaul education spending in the state by sending more money to certain schools, less to others. ABC 7 News Capitol correspondent Annette Miranda is live tonight with the story. Annette. Well, everyone agrees uh, poor and English learning students need help, but the political battle is over how to distribute extra money to their schools. We um, are going to stand our ground and make sure that it's done right. If they, people are going to fight it, they're going to get the battle of their lives. You I'm don't see that it. often. Democrats fighting among themselves at the state capitol. On top of the $50 billion for K-12 through education, Governor Brown wants to give roughly $2 billion more to school districts that have a higher concentration of poor and non-English speaking students. Senate Democrats unveiled a counterproposal that distributes the money more evenly. They say the governor's formula ignores sections of poverty within wealthy areas. If you're a poor kid who is in a district um, that does that, that is not considered poor you don't get the benefit of the additional money that creates a lot of invisible kids Daryl Steinberg's office says 36 percent of kids in Berkeley Unified for example are from low-income families but the district would not qualify for the extra grant under the governor's plan same is true for Torrance Unified 26 percent are low income and 13 percent don't speak English fluently yet no extra money for them either state senator Kevin de Leon who represents areas with a high Latino population says there's a better way to overhaul school financing. So they do need special uh, focus. They do need special attention. They need more resources. It's about money at the end of the day and how we use that money wisely. And you spread it out to all the districts, it'll have a trivial effect. If you put it into the districts of high concentrations of poverty, it'll have a very powerful effect. The governor insists his way is better. This is a matter of equity and civil rights. Governor and Senate Democrats also disagree on timing. Governor Brown wants the new funding formula to start this upcoming school year. Senate Democrats want to wait another year to make sure the change is done right. Live in Sacramento, Nanette Miranda, ABC 7 News.